Hi guys, I will omit all the fluff and just ask you one simple question. Do you want to go from Munich to the top of Zugspitze and come back within one day? I will tell you how to do it. According to Google Maps, Zugspitze located 100 kilometers away from Munich and it will take you around 3 hours to get there with public transportation. First one is regional train from Munich Halbanhof, Munich Central Station till Garmisch Patenkirchen. Then you take another train which will take you from Garmisch Patenkirchen till Eibze and from Eibze or you can continue, continue by the same train or you can take cable car which will take you directly to the peak of the mountain. There is also a bus from Garmisch Patenkirchen till Eibze, Eibze it's called uh, Eibze bus, something like this. But I will not cover it here, you can easily google it. So which tickets to buy? This is one of the most confusing parts. I will tell you now the most efficient way and most cheap way that I found so far. It's called Garmischer Zoma ticket and you can buy it online as for today for 77 euro. And now I'm going to show you how to buy Garmischer Zoma ticket. So you go to Google, you type in Garmischer Zoma ticket. Usually the first result is Deutsche Bahn. You go here. You choose yes Auswellen. So this is actually the ticket that you need. And uh, what you need to do? You go to offer and you need to choose which type of ticket you need. You need this Garmischer Zoma ticket Zugspitze Erwachsene. What does it mean? So this is the ticket to the top of Zugspitze for adult person. You see there is kinder, it's for children. So you choose this Erwachsene and don't get confused with all this classic ticket and so on. To the top of, top of the mountain goes only this one. So you choose it. You see the price changed to 77. Let's assume that you take it for yourself. You can choose the date, but it's desirable to buy it the day when you're gonna go there. Because of what? Because of weather. Wait, wait. The ticket, the type of ticket is printing ticket. Print ticket you see here. And you complete order. So this ticket covers your trip from Munich to Garmisch Patenkirchen using regional train. It looks like this. And now I'm gonna quickly show you how to find your trains. So you go to main website of Deutsche Bahn, then you put here like Munich, which is Munich, then Garmisch Patenkirchen, uh, one person, when it goes, second class, search. And so here you see time when the train departs. Don't pay attention to the price because you already bought Garmisch Zoma ticket, so it covers this train already. But how to read what is written here? So if you want to go to show details, watch what it actually tells you. It tells you that this train departs from platforms somewhere between 27 and 36 and it goes to Tutzing and then it looks like there is some building on the rails because here you have this Iwe bus. What does it mean? You arrive to Tutzing, you need to take this free bus which will take you to another station which is called Weilheim Ober Bay. There you can take the train and go forward to Garmisch Patenkirchen. Such situations are pretty common for Germany and it's very probable, for example, that when you will search for your train, such situation will not take place and you simply will go from Munich to Garmisch Patenkirchen directly. Then when you will arrive to Garmisch Patenkirchen, you have to change to Cogwell train. But before going there, you need to show this online ticket there on the cash desk and they gonna give you, as far as I know, it's called Bergbahn ticket which you will use for the trip on this cogwheel train and this ticket is also used to get into the cable car. So again, you need to change to another train and this is a little bit different station. This is just something like 100 meters from central station of Garmisch Patenkirchen so you can easily find it. So this cogwheel train, you can go with this train directly to the top of the mountain but there is a better way. You simply go with this train until I'm there, go away and simply change to cable car. Really, really huge cable car, which will very quickly take you up and you will see very nice views from there. 
and after some time on the top you can take this cogwheel train or you can take cable car to go down and then you repeat your trip to Munich back just another way around. And now let's quickly review uh, the second way of getting to Zugspitze if you use your own car. Going by car there will take you from two hours. Parking is not very expensive, so it will cost you around 10 euro, but you need to buy ticket to go up. And this ticket costs, ta -da, 68 euro and not less. And this ticket includes everything, ascent and descent to the top of the mountain, and also this cogwheel train, which can bring you uh, to Garmisch Partenkirchen and back. And you simply cannot refuse from it. You need to buy only this one. There is no discounts and nobody cares that you don't need this train. So as I said in the beginning, it looks like 77 euro combo ticket from Munich to Zugspitze and back is the most efficient and most cheap way to go there. So you don't depend on closed roads, you don't depend on traffic jams, on weather and so on. You simply pay once. Of course, you can do everything yourself. What matters how much you will pay in the end and how much time it eventually take. You won't believe me, but it took me two hours of research in the internet to understand what is the best way to get to the top of Zugspitze from Munich. Taking into account that I already live here five years and I understand German and I can imagine which pain can feel just ordinary tourist which plans his trip sitting somewhere in China. So that's why I've made this, I hope, simple video for you. Thank you for watching to the end. Stick around for more videos about Munich and Bavaria. Like, share, subscribe and watch one of the videos that you will see right now.